Good morning guys, it has just gone 9 o'clock and I'm on my first call out for the day. I am in the Umschlunga Ridge area going through to a housing estate here. Um, they have what appears to be a green mamba in a tree on the property. The guy has sent me a picture but the picture is taken from so far away and he's had to zoom up that it's really pixelated and I can't make out but there are a lot of green mambas in this particular estate so I think it will be one. Alright, while I drive through to the home I just wanted to apologize that I've been so quiet but uh, we have just gone through winter yeah and obviously in winter there's not much reptile activity so it's been extremely quiet and although we are almost a month into spring uh, things haven't quite picked up yet um, I am getting a few calls here and there but uh, I think from this point onwards you're going to start seeing some more regular videos Here's the security standing off uh, these guys have got snake catching equipment and that but they do not have the experience although they've perhaps done a course or whatever but when it comes to really dangerous snakes they stand back and let me do my thing on top there yeah uh, yeah Oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, just yeah, like I'll see yeah. there. Okay. Hey. Let's see if I can. Too long. No, if you know, yeah, there it is. It's just washing us. Right. So when security got the complaint and came through here, they were probably expecting something harmless because there are a lot of harmless green snakes here. But when they got you and saw the size of the snake and realized that this is a green mamba uh, they got the complainant to rather phone me and I have been to this particular premises a few times I've caught a spitting cobra here um, I've caught a green mamba I think anyway let me try to get up there I don't know how because this this bush has got very flimsy branches so I can't even stick a ladder up there because I've got nothing stable to put the ladder against to hold my weight so I don't quite know how I'm going to do this but I'm sure I'll make it work <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to just stick my ladder in the trees here and against all these flimsy branches and see if it'll take my weight. Not much else I could do. Let's see what I can do here. He's moving. Just help me to watch him. Yeah. Okay, it's a bit far now. As long as I've got people watching. Okay, let's get the ladder to another spot. Okay, we have lost sight of them guys, it's green snakes in greenery are very difficult to, to track 
when they're on the move. But I'm sure we'll spot them just now. Just carry on taking a look around here. All right, we have spotted him in here. There he goes through there, moving to the same place he was when I first went up. So let me move the ladder once again. Okay. Luckily, I'm not a heavy person, so although I'm just putting the ladder up, up against the flimsy trees and branches, it's enough to hold me. And if it gives way, it only gives way for a little bit and then something catches me again. Another branch or whatever. Okay, where are you? It was here somewhere. It's so dense. This foliage is just so dense. Okay, there you are. Trying to create a clearing here. Yeah, I can get through. Oh, oh. Don't know if I can reach, but I'm certainly going to try. Section of them there. It's about a meter and a half in from me. I'm trying not to make too much racket and shake the leaves and branches too much and spook it. Starting to move again. Okay, I have got it. Okay, so I've got hold of a tail and he's now wanting to turn to come see what is what is holding him. Okay, I've got a head, got the head. Okay, have to let go. I was hurting him. the head but he's still got a lot of body wrapped around branches yeah I'll try and gently persuade him out of here without putting too much without having to pull too much so I don't know how much of this you guys have seen because with the camera strapped to my chest I actually can't see where I'm where the lens is actually aiming He's quite underweight, the snake. Obviously, having just gone through winter, there hasn't been an abundance of food. And also, with it being cold, snakes haven't got a, um, a desire to eat. And if they did eat, they're going to battle to digest because their metabolism is too slow. So, as a result, the snake has lost a lot of condition during the winter. Right, yeah, so you can see he's a bit skinny. The spine is the spine is quite pronounced. But he's in fair condition. And he'll now begin eating. With it warming up, he'll begin eating again. I keep saying it's a he, but I don't know what it is yet. But uh, yeah, he or she will begin eating again and will put on weight and regain condition probably within a month, month and a half. Uh, the snake has been in the wars, it's got quite a bit of scarring on it. You can see those patches of like here by my fingers, 
where it's a lot more yellow. It's got some scarring there. Uh, it's also got quite a nasty one down, down over here. Almost looks like, like burns. I don't know what would have caused that. But apart from that, it's a nice healthy snake. Let's see if you're a boy or a girl. This is a boy, I can see that already. Oh, he's pooing. That is fecal matter coming out of there. But there's a boy snake. And let's get down. Let's get down. Thank you, Tree, for holding the ladder so stably for me. Don't give up now, please, while I've got a green mamba in my hands. <laughs> Mind you, if I fell, I would just hold on tight to the green mamba. <laughs> and try not to have it get hurt on the way down. There we go. Done. Okay, let's get it into a bag. I mean, it's quite an old snake. It looks like quite an old one. Yeah, a little bit old. <laughs> Not this time of the year. Um, the green mambas will. They will look for each other to mate normally in May or June. So this time of the year they're by themselves. <laughs> hey Snakey, see, I'm not so bad. Wasn't here to harm you. There's another one. I can smell that there's another one inside the car. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, this one is making that strong smell. Shame. It's very relaxed. Yeah, yeah, correct. It's not, not trying to get out of my hands. Yeah, or to strive. Yeah, he's happy. It's a happy snake. Okay. Let's just swap hands. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Got your head safely. Let's get your tail into my pinky finger. Let's actually try grab you like that. There we go. Right. Thanks for watching guys, see you on the next one.